See, one thing, one thing people don't know around here is we know everybody and everybody's got cameras. And we on the patrol, we gonna catch these guys. What's up everybody? So you're not gonna believe what's been going on lately. The other day I was on a little walk. I gotta tell you a story. I was on the walk. Check out the sunset. Woo. Actually, I was on a run. I was quasi run. Smith says I run, but I don't quite run. I run, I try, but I had my reflector belt on. I was hooding, had a hoodie on and I was cruising and it was dark and uh, I was walking and these these cops came up on me on bicycles some deputies they slammed on brakes and like hey man you that youtuber i was like yeah yeah i, I didn't know what how like like exactly what was going on because they just came up so fast they were on these electric bikes they were just like cruising real quiet and i was like yeah man yeah it's, you know how's it going you know like introduced himself super cool guy and he's like yeah we're just cruising the neighborhood you know you know things have been quiet i was like yeah man things have been real quiet around here you know i'm just doing my run i run a lot this time you know it's like 5 30 it's, it's dark now when it's at 5 30 but it was like 5 30. i was like yeah it's been quiet around here he's like oh that's good to know i was like yeah you know the neighborhood's really like trying to make sure the neighborhood watch is doing its thing and everything and uh there's some roofers over there roof and that's what's going on so i got done with my run i went home you know i went you know next morning i got this message it was Craig. He sent me this picture. And he's like, hey, bro, my green egg's gone. I was like, no, what? The green egg's not gone. Mine's right here. And he's like, no, it's gone. This is where it was right here. It's gone. It's there's, gone, Craig. There's the one it's gone. Cut. Oh, there's the snippet. Wow. You know, he lives one house, the house over. And he's like, it's gone. And he showed me a picture of a broken chain. And I was like, Craig, man. I was like, they got you. I was like, I told you not to put that thing in the front yard. And even though he had this giant chain hooked up on it, he gone. Okay. Little green's gone. Yep. Man. So I rushed over there and went into straight crime scene mode. And I was looking around. So we got circumstantial evidence uncovered here. You can see where they sat it down right there. They dumped it over right here. And I think they took it right down through there. See, one thing, one thing people don't know around here is we know everybody and everybody's got cameras. And we on the patrol, we're gonna catch these guys. Sure enough, there was a chain that had been cut sitting right there. So I got to looking around, did my, my scientific investigation, saw that there was uh, some shoe prints on the ground. They look like boots. And uh, where they had dropped the green egg, oh man, I was super mad. That's where they set it down right there. They flipped over the cart. Culprit's boot hill right there. Flipped it over. After they cut the chain, I bet you they went right down through there. Or I'm guessing right through there. That sounds like a better story. She's gone. Green egg. The green egg that sat right here is no longer yeah so everybody thinks the chain's gonna stop them the big nasty lock didn't snipped it right in half and i was madder than craig was craig was like oh man we won't call the cops i was like no nah, man we're calling the cops they you know about this you know they dumped it right here the little frame and then you know okay. and uh so sure enough nobody found that green egg it's been gone for a while now pretty mad Mine's right here, and if you want it, you're gonna work for it, son. I'm not gonna lie, I've been worried about somebody trying to steal this one, so I'm putting a chain on it. Gonna work for that one, too. Really, the stoplight's probably my pride and joy right now, because not too many people have one in their backyard. Pretty proud of, like I said, not too many people got one in their backyard, or one of these, or two of these out of Fulton County Stadium. So it was a broken hearted event. So don't forget to like this video. So maybe the YouTube algorithm will buy Craig another green egg. I'm just gonna wish it the best we possibly can for a bad scenario. But it's been a wild ride around here the last two months. I tell you, Samantha's had me renovating. I don't know if it's this marriage thing, but we tore up the entire kitchen. Mm, this stuff doesn't break like that. <laughs> Worst part, ugh. We went on a vacation up to Gunnersville. Open all the blinds up, Samantha. <laughs> so what we're gonna do in the mornings, drinking our coffee. We're gonna we're pretending. Look at this all view. All cuddly already. 
<laughs> I'm excited. Great place. Even I met a subscriber who found me in my log cabin. And fun fact, while we were in Gunnersville, I played Can Jam for the first time. He hurts! <laughs> that was uneventful. I was hoping you'd fall in. I don't know if you've no ever noticed Can Jam, but it's pretty fun. I've been quite the backyard game collector. Can Jam, Bucket Pong. If you haven't seen that one, check it out. We played it the other night. Crazy Tall Jenga. Real size Jenga backyard on a tree stump is the way to go. It's it's gone. <laughs> but just for, you know, hiding out in the backyard and playing some games, that has been pretty fun. Samantha has been doing one heck of a job on the drywall, covered in dust 90% of the time, and uh, it's take up took up most of my time. I didn't get to make any videos hardly. And got a real estate license, and that's been taking up a lot of my time, too. So it's raining. It's Christmas Eve, and we're out here hustling real estate. Check out this one. Uh-oh. There we go. Right there. Throw official, them out. Official Throw them document. Woo-hoo-hoo-hoo. 5-0. 5-0. That's again. Trip again. There it is. Boom. Did there you see it that? is. Oh, it's man. tripping. This is why you have a flashlight and an experienced realtor like Jack Motley is for us to be able to pick these things out because, you know, that right there is going to be at least an $8,000 fix. That's right. Place. Well, we got a ton of water, wood rot, all kinds of organisms been gnawing on that port. My guess is all these have got to come down and be replaced. That, they got a tarp here. It's a random Walmart tarp. Basically keeping the water out. Roof that looks like it's from Home Depot on a Saturday afternoon. Boom, Saturday and, uh, afternoon. Ooh, look at this, look at this. A little bit of wood rot. Lots of wood rot. Yeah, ooh, I'm ooh. good at finding wood rot. I've been looking at it for days. Boom. Hey, you can make this into bunk beds. That's right. Woo! Airbnb right here, baby. Airbnb We're all day. So if you're buying or selling here in Florida, I'm your man. Also, if you're looking for vacation rentals, I can do that too. I will say this. We're still on the hunt for that guy and the green egg. I got a lead on it, but then it disappeared again. And I'm, go I'm not gonna lose faith that we're gonna get this green egg back. I wanted to give you guys an updated video. I know I posted a video yesterday, but I'm on the grind. 2021 is gonna be my year, everybody. It's gonna be my year. You know why? Because I'm gonna try to make as many videos as I possibly can because I'm not crawling under houses renovating anymore. I got that January entrepreneurial high. And uh, we'll see if we can get a gold play button. I'm just being wistful. Super pumped about this year. We're going to do it, guys. Yak Motley Nation is going to do it. I'll see you guys later.